HKPFS was established by the Research Grant Council of the Hong Kong government in order to attract the best students in the world who will pursue PhD studies in Hong Kong. In the past several years, the college's high success rate has outperformed the university benchmark. Currently, we have more than 20 fellows coming from different regions and countries. The generous funding and scholarship will ease the world is a financial burden. Apart from monthly stipend and conference travel allowance for three years, which will be provided by the scheme, CDU will cover the fourth year of study and will provide the student with additional financial support, including tuition fee waive and on-campus accommodation during the first year of study. Hello. 我叫李文浩，我是香港城市大学中文及历史系的博士生。I'm Natasha Hazarika. I'm from India. I'm pursuing PhD in the Department of Public Policy, City University of Hong Kong. I decided to pursue a PhD because I always wanted to go for higher studies. It was just the next step for me in this process of cultivating my personal interests. Um, because CTU has some of the best uh, faculty in here and the field that I'm working on uh, that is sustainability transition and bridging science and policy. CTU has an excellent academic reputation. So the Department of Public Policy is working extensively on those fields. Uh, but class also have other academic units that are working on related issues that uh, are closely related to my own research. So I think it creates a very nice academic environment for me to be in. So I thought it's the best choice. Yeah, in my research, I am studying the intellectual history of the Song Dynasty. My research is about environmental innovations in the construction industry. Well, as a student majoring in Chinese studies, uh, Hong Kong is a natural place for me to go to because it's close to the historical and cultural heritage of China. So Hong Kong has one of the most bustling construction industries in the world, but at the same time it is also criticized for being uh, too top-down and too rigid. And so there are a lot of political and uh, socio-economic factors that, you know, influence the construction industry. So I think it's very, mm, you know, new to understand about it. First of all, I get monthly stipend. It uh, covers the tuition fee in the first year and also covers on-campus accommodation. Yeah, it's very good. I can work without any financial burden. The most concrete benefit of this is that it takes away my financial burden so I can focus on what is important, namely research. Exciting experiences would be when I got to attend a lot of uh, international conferences. Interactions with other scholars and students here. To meet some of the best researchers in my field, uh, which was quite overwhelming. So I would say that when you go for a PhD, don't just look for a supervisor, look for a mentor. And explain why they think Hong Kong is the best place for them to conduct their research. Come to CTU class and join us. Apply for Hong Kong PhD Fellowship Scheme now.